Oh. All right, Ron, way to go, way to go. Well, I'm at Wilna Pond. No luck yet. I've seen some fish over here. I don't know if the camera angles right. As I'm splashing around the water a little bit. But this is such a gorgeous place out here. There's a few people here, not many. But, oh man, it's beautiful. It's already hot. I don't know what the temperature is. About 72 degrees. I did remember sunblock today. See if I can entice something with this lizard. I got a hit around the corner over there, but I panicked and set the hook too fast. So I'm going to count that as a miss. I don't know if these fish are on the bed in here yet or not. Really dirty water, it's hard to say with all the rain I guess we've had. Let me go around the corner here. It really is beautiful. If you're not getting outside, you're missing you're missing out on life, man. That's all I gotta say. Missing out on life itself. No, I did see a I'm gonna try a top water over there, because that's where I did see a um fish breaking it. Break, breaking the surface. You know, even not catching fish is fun, but just being out here is, is half of it. I ain't gonna lie to you. Just being out on the water. And um, it's so easy just to say I'm too lazy to go pack up the boat and not do it. And, um, you know, once, once you, whoa, look at that cast. Once you get on the water, you're pretty much, you're pretty much satisfied that you, uh, you did the right thing. It's beautiful. If it wasn't so far, I'd be here more often. Yeah, I think it's a little bluegill back there tearing it up. Or frogs. It could be a frog back there in that one. All right, let me go. Scope out some more areas in this pond, see what it's all about. Never been here. Let me get me some water. I'm telling you, it's gonna be a hot day. You gotta hydrate. Got my water with my 4C green tea in it. Back in a minute. There he is. He's a little muskrat. Hey, little fella. 
muskrat. I don't know what it is. I know it ain't no beaver. A beaver be mad as hell right about now. Let's see what he does. Where he goes. Might be a beaver. I don't know. Minus his own damn bit. Eyes are closed. Okay. He's cruising. Do his thing. A gnarly looking fella. Yeah, that was a beaver because I turned the camera off and um, he decided to go under the water. When he did, he slapped his tail like he was mad shit. Anyway, pretty cool seeing wildlife out here. I haven't seen no fish, but I haven't seen anybody else catching any either. So, which is a plus, so to speak. Makes me feel a little bit better about myself. Just don't know what to throw. Water's dirty. It's um, water temperature is 66 degrees. So you'd think the fish would be spawning. I haven't found any super shallow areas in here. Five feet, four feet, maybe, but I don't know. I'm watching how everybody else is fishing. If I was doing the same thing, it looks like throwing. Some kind of spinner bait or a chatter bait. I've thrown that and I got this lizard on here and oh no. Hoping to drag it across the bed, piss off some big old mama fish trying to lay some eggs. pull my drive up because of this log here that I want to go across because I want to go around this edge here. So I want to get the paddle out. Probably do. Probably do. Oh, I hit that side. Okay. Uh, pretty good boys well I made my way back up into the <laughs> the swamp section um, still no luck either it's me or the fish are hiding from me I was talking to that guy in that John boat a minute ago didn't have the camera on but he was telling me that he's caught about four or five and I heard him catch one. It was slapping the shit out of the water and it was, he said it was almost probably close to a four pounder. And he told me what he's using, which is pretty cool. And of course that's what I've been throwing too. Oh, except for I've been throwing it in trees. Oh, I scared a fish. So, I don't know, it's a cool lake. Um, he told me that, you know, you don't catch a lot of fish, but the fish you catch are, are, are nice, so. Basically, quality over quantity here. So I guess if you do catch a fish, chances are it's going to be a pretty nice one. Unfortunately, Ron cannot catch a fish today. Something out there in the lily pads raising hell. I don't know what it was. Some frogs out here, I'll tell you that. All right, so there we go. Lily pads are thick. All right, so let me paddle my way out of here so I can put my motor back down. Still, what the hell is that? There's tree, is there are stumps and everything all in this lake. Way to go, way to go, way to go, way to go, way to go. You gotta be shitting me.
I want to take a couple of minutes and thank you. If you watched the video all the way to the end and you're seeing this, I really, really appreciate it. I'll put my email address and my mailing address right over here somewhere. And if you have stickers you want to send me, I'd appreciate it. Talk to y'all again soon. Goodbye.